different video than the usual loot crate today. Uh, I've had this box since I think Saturday, but I've had a busy weekend and I've only just kind of got around to it because I'm playing Red Dead Redemption. In case that doesn't give it away, this is the box that's in front of me. It's in its delivery packaging at the minute, but this box that's in front of me is indeed some of the collector's edition bits and pieces from Red Dead. So, as my understanding goes, you could buy the game and the collector's edition bits separately. Okay, it was a strange, strange system. So, you can buy the game and you, you can buy like, it, there was like an ultimate edition and then there's like a collector's edition and I'm not sure if it was the same collector's edition as this but yeah it was very strange anyway I bought the game separately and um, I'm gonna sit back up because it was quite low <laughs> um, so yeah this is the collector's edition without the game I don't I'm not entirely sure if that's that's gonna be different from anything else so let me just get it out of the it's a box in a box as usual and it's quite heavy Okay, so I'm just going to take plastic film off first before I show you the box. <laughs> it's, it's good. It's lovely. Okay, so that's the box so far on the side. I can't remember it. I, I can't remember the guy's name so far. Is that Bill? That's Dutch anyway. I know that's Dutch. I don't think that's Bill. I can't remember the names just yet. And the lady. I haven't actually met the lady yet. And on the back we have the Rockstar logo. Fantastic. I'm going to set it down because there's quite a lot of weight in it. Something metal. Let me just do this for you. Hang on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's right. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. Okay, first of all, a tiny little lock. Tiny little lock and key. Wow. I, I thought it was going to be, I thought there was, I've got it here. I thought there was going to be, you know, I thought it was just going to have, you know, bits and pieces in this box. But there's another box. Oh, that's fantastic. No wonder it's so heavy. Fantastic. Look at this. That's metal. Very thin metal, I believe. Look at that. Red Dead. Fantastic. Cornwall. And commodities. Oh, don't want to open it just yet. See so if we can get some light on that. That's lovely. Nice and inlaid. So set into the box and the banding all the way around. Beautiful little box. Absolutely beautiful. Open this beast up. And we have nothing revealed yet. We're still getting into it. Okay, that's a book. Okay, if any of you have played it, hopefully, hopefully a lot of you have played it, that's why you're watching this. Um, if you go up to the shop, if you go up to the, the, the counter in the shop, there's, you can look through the catalog, and boom, that is literally the catalog that you look through. 18, the original Wheeler Rawson and Co. Catalog edition number 153, the cheapest supply house on earth. Our trade reaches around the world. 1899. Please show this catalogue to your friends and neighbours. And we have the Wheeler and Rossum Company warehouse, I presume, on the back. Fantastic. Our purpose, yeah, our purpose built warehouse. Medard, Medard Avenue, St. Dennis, 
14,000 square foot of goods. Please show this catalog to your friends and neighbors. Let's have a looky look in here. actual page for page catalogue that you look through buying your guns so this is obviously the interactive menu that in game revolvers pistols repeaters rifles shotguns ammunition accessories etc that you literally oh it is literally it is literally the catalogue that you look through so you've got your cattleman revolver your double action revolver there $50 $65 Schofield revolver for volcanic pistol. All in there. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. The um, the print is lovely as well. Semi-automatic pistol, 210. The Mo I may pronounce this Mauser. The Mauser pistol, I believe. The German pistol, $250. Oh, that's awesome. The fact that like you look through it in game and then I've literally got it. Lynch, Litchfield, repeater, varmint, the varmint rifle. I got the varmint rifle. I can tell you, don't use it in a gunfight. You'll lose. It is weak. Bolt action rifle, $180. Rolling block rifle, $187. Carsano Car rifle, $190. I've got my eye on that one because when he puts the gun out he's like when you see somebody with his gun you know they're bad and I can't buy it yet it's, it's not it's not it's still locked the sword the sword off shotgun a young boy's first gun for the man that enjoys wielding an honest surprise shoots a pattern in your target dainty as a needle worker <laughs> oh this is so good uh, double barreled shotgun a gun built to be, to be used in one hand friend friend when you are in between places a rock and a hard place I suppose I suppose pump action shotgun semi-automatic shotgun holds multiple rounds the Lancaster classic possibly the most shot the most popular shotgun made a crowd dispersing favorite <laughs> oh that's so good repeating shotgun an unrivaled marvel of power and then you've got all your all your ammunition types that is fantastic predator bit a pocket watch genuine nickel plated case regular 18 size heavy glass a beautiful watch coffee percolator I should buy one of them actually I have coffee you can own a watch I love all these like old dainty adverts that's fantastic. Magic Lantern Projector. And then we got some tinned goods. You will no longer have to store food in a hole. <laughs> Is that what they done? Did they actually? Oh, wow, well, it's just... Look at that. Look at that. Look at these old adverts. You know? Drugs. Drug department. Uncle Earl, Uncle Earl's uh, bitters, potent snake oil, potent miracle tonic. Oh, look at this hipster right here! Look at this guy! Look at that majestic beard! Look at that! Oh, it's so wispy! Oh, I'm so glad I got this. Do not be cruel to your horses. Order food from our grocery department and feed to horses for health. Horse care and veterinary supplies. Clothing department. Oh, it's got the clothing department as well. The Bulldogger, $74. The Ranch Hand, the Scrapper. I actually haven't found um, anyone who sells clothes. The McLaughlin, the Armadillo. What's that? The far Ferrer? Ferrer? An outfit that is a wee gentle reminder of home. The Donegal. That's um, in Northern Ireland, where I'm from. 
gallant and stylish. These are top rate garments. The Chevalier, Chevalier, the Heartlands, an outfit curated for gentlemen of the plains. The Gambler, the Earl. This is all. This is all amazing. The Cumberland, the, the cow puncher, the cow puncher, the cow puncher, $102, it can be yours. Our finest workwear and trapping on offer. The tumbleweed, the drifter, I could go on. Oh, they sell hats as well. They sell hats all in here, that's fabulous. Oh, I'm just gonna skip a few pages. We got jackets, gloves, you know everything in there that's absolutely beautiful really really that's good really lovely little piece there on to the next one a very thin piece of paper it's a treasure map I believe that's what that looks like that's what it looks like a treasure map what if this is an in-game are they that good what's well, upside down as well goodness that's a mountain one two three what if it's in game you can't really see it it's that thin that is perplexing that is what if it's an in-game thing as well that would be insane I love the style of all this. We got a bandana, lovely little bandana, with um, hopefully you can see, make out the guns, the pistols, and the knives. You know? Yep. I can do some robbing with this boy. You don't know who I am. You don't even know who I am. You don't even know who I am right now. Who am I? It's quite difficult to breathe. I'm gonna just take the film off again before I show you guys this next box. Yeah. Get yeah, now. Says Barilla. Red Dead Redemption 2. Challenge coin. Big old buffalo. I haven't came across challenge coins either or what they are in game, so I don't know what this is. Obviously it's a coin. Oh. Goodness me, that is quality. Let me just take it out of the case. Does it open? Oh, it does open. Okay, so it's magnetized. I want to put it on because I don't want to get my fingerprints all over it. But look at that. Let's see if I can get some light on this. Look at that. You, oh, you can't really see it. Trust me, this is a piece of work. Not really doing it justice on the camera here, guys. Fantastic. But yeah, it's magnetized, so it comes off and the coin does come out, but I'm not going to touch it. Outlaws for life on the back there, if you can see it. You can't see it. A powerful symbol of the American front. The American, pardon me, the American bison were hunted near extinction in the late 1800s quite difficult to read there what if I just got really close can you make it out fantastic absolutely top quality item there really like it looks quality I'm gonna put it back in its box put that back in lovely lovely item on to the next one Slightly bigger. I'm gonna wrestle it. Hang on, what if I move this side? What's that? Is that okay? This is okay. Leave the bigger box. We got some little bits in here. So we got a little pouch. Little Red Dead Redemption pouch. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is a bit husky. I do apologize. I get. Oh, okay. The pouch. <laughs> there are. Um, Okay, you can't really see it, but they're pins. Several pins. Lovely. Several pins. 
How many? One, two, three, four, six pins. Get out your pistol. Get out your pistol. Can't make out the quality. Or is that the shotgun? No, that's the double barrel. That's the sawn off shotgun. My apologies. Got your rifle. Rifle. Uh, Bowie knife. That's your, your revolver there. You can't really see it. If the camera would focus, Tomahawk. Tomahawk. And what is that? Don't know what that is. Just an X marks the spot, I think. It's not focusing. I think that's just an X marks the spot. Lovely little pins. Yeah, very delightful. Everybody knows I love a good pin. Again, top quality, man. On to the next little box. I just get this film off, man. I'm so glad I, I got this when I did. So I wasn't gonna get it. Because I thought, you know, don't really need it, but I'm so glad I did. This is fantastic so far. Really hard. What are these? Cigarette cards! 12 pictures packed inside each box. <coughs> Collector's card series number one. I've got a couple of these in game. None of them are rare, I don't think. Oh goodness. Quite a few of them. Oh wow. Oh yeah! I'm gonna just show you a couple. Focus. Kind of looks like uh, Christopher Walken. Dr. Hawthorne, so that's Valentine. Oh, Valentine. And Maud. Oh, one slipped out the bottom there. We have, what is that? Sage, something Sage. Robert Elliot. Patchin. He's in chain mail. Uh, we have the coral snake. Delightful. What's that? Hot air balloon. Hot air balloon. Very good. <laughs> uh, red rocket. The big headed guy. How good is that? How good is that? What's this? Uh, cylinder phonograph. Cylinder phonograph. Leviticus Cornwall oil tycoon. Oh, I've met. I haven't met the person Cornwall. I've heard the name Cornwall. Cornwall. Jim Boy Calloway. Some sort of cowboy. Oh, and it's a horse. What horse? The American paint. Just the American paint. And the American paint. How delightful. Lovely. Oh, it's got bits on the back as well. Famous Gunslingers and Outlaws Series 1. Frank Heck, Otis Miller Boys, Butcher Brothers, and it's just got a list. Prominent Americans, Amazing Inventions, The World's Champions, uh, Marvels of Travel, Fauna of North America, Stars of the Stage, Wild Flora, uh, The Fairest Flowers and Gems of Beauty, this is Scenery Cities of America, artists, painters, writers, and poets, and you have breeds of horses. Fantastic. And then let me just show you some of the backs. So it's just got lists of outlaws, and you know, it's just some little pieces of information. Wild flora. Flora? Yeah. Fantastic. I'm gonna go ahead and say that this one Probably a deck of cards. Not that that's like disappointing or anything. That's that's good, you know. I don't mean that in the in the bad sense. So I've got a pair of scissors here. Get in there. People are gonna be like, "You might damage it." I know I might, but I'm also pretty good at opening things. That's 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 my skill set. Taking things out of other things. Red Dead Redemption 2. Joker. Joker. Who's that? Oh, his uncle is for 
Javier, that's the guy on the front. Oh, I, I just freed this guy. I done the I done the mission for this guy. The two guns. I'm not trying not to give you any spoilers, but I was trying to pronounce his name. I think it's. I'm not even gonna try it. Fuck it. Yeah, lovely. Like if you can see them, they're sort of they're kind of scribbled. It's kind of scribbled on. Are they butterflies even? No, they're kind of. It's kind of difficult to tell. There's old John Marston. Anybody played the first one? You got old John. John Marston Abigail. I believe that's his wife. Correct me if I'm wrong. Charles. Oh, nearly dropped them all. Charles Smith. With the, the sawn off. You get the idea. Lovely little cards. I don't think there's anybody else special in here. Sadie. I haven't met Sadie yet. Oh, big man himself, Arthur Morgan. The big dog. <laughs> the big man. Yeah, diamonds. I don't know why, but this five of diamonds has an eagle in it. Five of diamonds, five of diamonds. Bill Williamson. I implore you. And the king of diamonds himself, Mr. Dutch. Mr. Dutch Von D. Linde. Linde? That's not right. Mr. Dutch. Beautiful set of cards. I will never use them. <laughs> Maybe I will. Who knows? Okay. On to the big piece. Now that I've got the little bits out of the way, onto the large box. Again. Uh, City of St. Dents, I think that reads. The font is quite difficult. City of St. Dents, correct me if I'm wrong. A map puzzle. Yeah, oh, St. Dennis, that's not a T, that's an I. St. Dennis. Okay, map puzzle, map puzzle. If it's a genuine jigsaw, I'm not going to sit here and do it. Oh, goodness me. <laughs> Oh, it's a puzzle, all right. Jigsaw pieces. <laughs> Genuine jigsaw. I will have to do this eventually. I will have to. But I'm not going to. Are they like wooden pieces? Are they proper? Like wooden. You know, like modern ones are kind of like that cardboard. These are like wood. Jeez. I mean, I don't know why I'm showing you this. It's just a jigsaw piece. Doesn't really make sense without the rest of it. Yeah, gen like they feel like wood. I'm gonna say they are wood. Wow, quality. Laser cut. This bag is not a toy. No, it is not. Oh, get that all back in. Oh, goodness. Yeah, that's it, guys. That is the last item in the collector's uh, I was gonna say chest. I can't get it back into. The, I can't get the jigsaw pieces. Okay, I can't. I got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Put the put the lid on. Oof, don't don't break me. Jigsaw pieces, map puzzle box. I'm gonna put you back in. And then we have the cards, the deck of cards. Fantastic. Really outdone yourselves, Rockstar. Very well done on the pieces. Very well done. It's not very well fanned. You can't really see it. I'll stop that. I'm going to stop that. Put that away. Put that away. See, the problem is, do I just keep everything in the box? Do I keep everything in the box and keep it pristine, or do I have it on show? I like having the things on show. I'm gonna put the pins back in. The gun pins, they go back in. Boop. They go back in here. Cigarette cards, fantastic little pieces. Cigarette cards. Boys upside down. Boys upside down. What's his name? Jim Boy Callaway. Cornwall. Oil Tycoon, I suspect 
<laughs> I love that one. I suspect I'll be running into Cornwall at some point. I robbed his train. Spoiler alert. If that's a spoiler, you yeah, haven't played Red Dead, let's be honest. Come on. I'm gonna put that back in. I'm gonna tuck that away. And then that goes in. And then Red Dead Redemption Challenge coin. Really, really quali quality coin there. I really enjoy that. I'm gonna show you it one last time. Because it's that good. See if I can get it up nice and close. Can't, does not do it. Look at it. It's a lovely piece. It's a lovely, lovely piece. Thank you, Rockstar. Well done. Fantastic. Gonna put that back in. I think. Oh, treasure chest. Which I absolutely. I'm gonna say that's in. In game, I reckon you could find it in game. Maybe I should take a picture of it. I'll take a picture of it later. The catalog, which I think this might be the best, the best piece. I think the catalog. It's just like a genuine catalog. It's fantastic. I love it. It's beautiful. Absolutely on the money. Close the box within the chest. Gentle. Gentil. Don't want to damage the catalog. Get in there. Get in there, man. Come on. Don't be like this. Why are you not going in? Come on. Oh, I see. I see what the problem is. Okay. The cardboard box inside the metal tin has got itself caught underneath the lip. Not a big deal. I can fix that. I can fix that. There we go. Job done. And then all we do is push it in. There you go. Close the tin box. Oh, and the bandana. Came with a bandana. Sauce. The bandana, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of closy. If I lost this, can you imagine if I put this lock on? Because they only give you one key. Can you imagine if I lost this key? I'd be livid. I'd be mad. I mean, that's like for the little item that it is. It's, you can kind of, you can feel it, you know. There's weird in it. Let's get the lock open. And that, that's us. That is us, folks. Keep this key safe. What am I gonna do? Yeah, that is it. All locked up. No getting into that unless you're an outlaw. No. Oh. Anyway, that is it for the Red Dead Redemption Collector's Edition unboxing. Uh, absolutely fantastic box. Absolutely fantastic. All good artwork. All fantastic. Absolutely just rock star. Well done on those pieces. Really well done. Oh, I love the catalog. I love the coin. Everything was good, everything, I love the style. Cowboys, fantastic, oh, just one of the best, one of the top collector's pieces I've gotten. Definitely, it's, it's up there, it really is. Really, just all quality pieces. Anyways, folks, thank you for joining in. I will hope to see you in November time. Red Dead Redemption Online comes out then. I am gonna be all over that. Loving the game so far. If you haven't picked it up, absolutely do. Fantastic game. Fantastic items. Just thank you for watching. And I will see you again next time. Goodbye, folks.